The 2015 San Antonio Spurs off to another tremendous run. It makes me reflect back on great Spurs teams of the past and how I can relate to this team. Well, I'll go all the way back to 99. I think that 99 team was a transition team. David Robinson was at the end of his career and he relented to the talented Tim Duncan and Tim Duncan became their go-to guy. And we're seeing the same thing here Whereas LaMarcus Aldridge signed from the Portland Trailblazers this summer in free agency, he's taking over for Tim Duncan, and Tim Duncan obviously reciprocating for what David Robinson taught him, and now you look at that Spurs team and you're seeing the same transition. And both teams had a tremendous third player. The 99 team had Sean Elliott, and Sean Elliott made big shot after big shot, was highly counted on. And now Greg Popovich is throwing a lot of responsibility at the talented Kawhi Leonard. And Kawhi Leonard is having an MVP type season. Not only leading the Spurs in scoring, but he's also their best shooter, their best defender. And now the point guard position. Look, Tony Parker historically is better than Avery Johnson, but now they're both asked to do the same thing, right? Avery was asked to keep the rhythm of the game moving, play defense, and be that facilitator that they needed. Well. I think Parker is asked now to do the same thing. Not counted on heavily to score consistently, but asked to really be a facilitator and be a leader out there on the floor. So if you want to get some insight on the Spurs organization and how they build, they really have not changed from 99 to 2015. They just understand where you fit. They are ultimate role players. And that's why they're consistent winners every year.